Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Callum and I are hanging out here at the house today. It's been raining off and on. Roman has class, of course. Um, but my mom sent us a bunch of like patriotic decorations for 4th of July coming up like this. So I think we might decorate the apartment for 4th of July. What do you think? Does that sound like a plan? For 4th of July? Here, you wanna help? What do we do with that? Hmm? Hmm? You hand it to mom. <laughs> That's what we do. Huh? Wanna put those on? Look at that. <laughs> Good job. Good job. That's so patriotic. <laughs> I love that. Don't you love it? Hmm? Yeah? Okay, I'll let you hold that. You can keep that. Okay? Yeah. This is such a tight elevator. Oh my god. It's like in Athens. I know. We're in Italy. Right? We are in Stuttgart. Um, we'll go into Baby Vibes to see if we can get a. Um... Kelsey, 3.0. <laughs> We're going to try this for the third time. Yeah, I got it. You got it? Can we see Callum? <laughs> He's just chilling. Yeah, so we're in Stuttgart. Hopefully we can make the decision today and be done with it. And then we have the car seat and then we just have to get Callum used to it. Um, but well, that's a cute little store, whatever that is. What? Yeah, CG kid. How cute is that? That's where we're going. Right up there. Boom. Okay, so it's pretty much between this Cybex. Oh, that's a kitty. I mean, this kitty. <laughs> or this Cybex. That's the other option. Hmm. You wanted the kitty, right? And we can get that if you want. Well, why don't we go with this one then? Okay, then I'll ask them if they can show us how it works. Yeah. Okay, let's do that. Hi, little boy. Hi, little boy. We're getting you your new car seat. He just woke up from his nap, so he's still a little tired. You watching the kids? Are you come here. So. Yeah. <laughs> huh? So, 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 Good. Good job, Callum. Yeah. Super. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Da brauchen Sie denn die dazu? Die Station. Der geht dann nur auf die Superwaschstelle. All right, Callum. You're in a big boy seat. It's as safe as they come. Huh? What do you think? <laughs> Is that better? 
Oh my gosh, this is so mind blowing to me right now. He looks so little. You know, like he looked so big in his old car seat. Now he looks so little in the new one. <laughs> Oh, where's that cushion missing? There's that cushion and uh, bring some higher. Oh, that sits him higher. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh. Hast doch mehr Platz für deine Beine, hä? Huh? <laughs> I'm glad it works out. Yeah. yeah. About this car seat, it's a kitty car seat. And this is a rental. Um, we'll pick up the actual car seat that will be his on Monday um, if, it works out. if it works out so it worked out well because we chose to take one home to test over the weekend um, and basically see how it how it works in our car and how he how he responds in it if if it goes well then we just bring it back and then we pick up his actual car seat oh man well, we're getting emotional. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> I just, it's just so weird to turn around and see him right there. And he's like looking and oh, he's just so big. Oh, I can't believe it. How are you not emotional? <laughs> I just can't believe it. I can't believe we're done with his baby seat. Like I, I can't believe that. It's really over. Yeah, it's we over. It's pretty much over. <laughs> you know, it's it's done. It's a done deal. Anyways, we're on our way to Asia. <laughs> it's so crazy to see you and then see him right behind you. So could you explain? why this is safe like what what makes this system so safe well if you have a front crash and he's how do you say bouncing forward or, uh -huh. you say? and with the table that he has the, the table will take a lot of the energy off his head and off his neck and so it is safer front crash than another seat. Uh -huh. So this is safer than a rear facing? Yeah. But then why, why, I don't know why this is not as common in the States though. Like, we spent so much time researching this and not just researching but talking to like engineers and, um, and talking to people that work in, um, or that have worked with the crash What's it called? The Crash Center? We talked to a lot of people and we've done so much research and um, this is like the safest of the safest of the safest. And the car seat that we're actually getting for him was rated number one in Germany, in Austria, in Switzerland. I mean, it's like a really big deal. And I've said this before, but if something happens to his car seat, like if we're in a crash um, at all, if we're in any sort of accident, then the company Kitty will replace his car seat for free. So they they put a lot of trust into their into their product, and they really trust that it's going to hold up and it's going to do well and it's going to protect you know the, the child. And for me, that's important. So I feel really good. I know that it's kind of different than the way things are in the states, but different doesn't necessarily mean worse it doesn't mean anything it's just different and this is what's recommended by German engineers by people that work observing the Autobahn and you know the, the crash center safety and all that stuff so we're gonna go with that we're gonna trust that and um, we both feel really good about this decision so um, yeah, so we know that Callum will be safe. We feel very confident that he'll be safe and well taken care of. And what we were told by someone that works with the crash safety is that with him sitting forward in this kind of car seat, the way it is, um, it'll lessen the chance, if we're in any accident at all, it'll lessen the chance of him being paralyzed because he doesn't have the straps that are close to any parts of his body. Um, like Roman said, he's got the table that will absorb a lot of the shock. So, we're good with that. I'm good with that. Now, and we're gonna go to Etika. 
Yeah, Erika. Yeah. Erika. Yeah. Erika. You're at Erika like every day. <laughs> we went home for a little bit and had dinner. Um, but now we are out and about again. We are looking for um, basically a place to grill for the 4th of July. Oh, how beautiful is that? Oh, that's so gorgeous. Isn't that pretty, Callum? Oh, wow, yeah. wow, yeah. Um, the 4th of July is on a Saturday this year and Roman does not have class on that day, so we decided that it would be really fun to get together with a few friends and grill out and get the families together and just have like a really fun, low-key family grill out barbecue kind of thing. This is really gorgeous. Yeah, they look weird. Wow. Yeah, they look like they're on fire. Wow. It's amazing. really far out here. Gorgeous. There's the little moon. <laughs> and now where the other one is? We're looking for a place for your 4th of July party. We finally have Callum in bed. Um, he actually started getting really sleepy in the car uh, when we were driving around looking at places. Tomorrow's gonna be a bit of a busy day. Um, family's coming in for Roman's mom's birthday, so uh, we'll be hanging out with family mostly tomorrow. And thank you guys for watching. And um, as always, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and please leave us a comment. We love reading them and uh, like this video. And if you haven't found us on Facebook, check the link below. Um, I'll put the link below to our Facebook page and you'll see videos posted up there as well as other little things that we, that we put up. So thank you guys for watching again. We love you. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.